guy there. Maybe we didn't survive that crash. Maybe all this is purgatory. We have to atone for all the shit we've done before we can leave this place. We have to suffer before God will grant us salvation. Listen up, deputy. I'm thinking we've reached the end of the line. Time to cowboy up and deal with Joseph Seed once and for all. He's waiting for you at his church. Your gun's your best friend. Gotta look. Wish ammo was easier to come by. You can't imagine living down there for years. When the Lamb broke the fifth seal, I saw under the altar the souls of the martyrs, slain because of the word of God. You made martyrs of my family. And I am prepared to do the same to yours. God is watching us and he will judge us on what we choose in this moment. I told you that we were living in a world on the brink for every slight, every injustice, where every choice reveals our sins. And where have those sins led us? 
Where have those sins led you? Your friends have been taken and tortured. And it's your fault. Countless people have been killed, and it is your fault. The world is on fire, and it's your fault. Was it worth it? Was it? When are you gonna realize that every problem cannot be solved with a bullet? When you first came here, I gave you the choice to walk away. You chose not to. In the face of God, I'm making you that offer one last time. You put down your guns. You take your friends. You leave me my flock. Go in peace. Go in peace. You're fucking insane. Is he? We never should have been here in the first place. You know what to do, Rook. Watch the world suffer and burn and swallow your pride. And the Lamb broke the sixth seal, and lo, there was a great earthquake. And the sun became black, and the moon's on the floor.
Seal. There was silence in heaven. And the seven angels before God were given seven trumpets. And there were noises, thunderings, lightnings, and an earthquake. Joseph Seed, you're under arrest. And I heard a great voice from the temple say to the angels, go your ways and pour from the vials the wrath of God upon the earth.
You know what this means? It means the politicians have been silenced. It means the corporations have been erased. It means the world has been cleansed by God's righteous fire. But most of all, it means I was right. The collapse has come. The world as we know it is over. I waited so long. I waited so long for the prophecy that God whispered in my ear to be fulfilled. I prepared my family for this moment. And you took them from me. for what you've done. But you're all I have left now. You're my family. And when the world is ready to be born anew, we will step into the light. I am your father. And you are my child. And together we will march to Eden's 